What's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel. I hope everyone is having a great day today. And if you're not, maybe this will help you a little bit. We have some new mods that will be coming to Farming Simulator pending their testing, of course. But this gives us something to look forward to and lets us know, hey, this is what Giants is working on right now. And this is awesome. So starting off with console, we have some things that have moved from PC testing to console testing. Now, I know I've told you guys this before, but I will say it again. When mods go into Giants, the very first thing they do is they go through their initial testing and the PC testing. And then they move on to console testing if they have passed the PC testing. So when you see stuff that says PC, that means that it's in testing for PC. Doesn't mean that it's only for PC, just means that it is in testing for PC at that moment. And then things move to console. And you may see some changes from previous. Let's jump right into it. Yeah, yeah. First up for console, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, we have Silage Fork, which would be a Silage Fork. We also have the Metal Tech PBD8. Now, we went over this last week. This is a bell trailer very similar to the Flegal Bell trailer that we have in game right now, but still, it's a very cool mod. One thing I really liked using was using the Flegal Auto Load. And then I would unload them onto this trailer, lock them down, because you can hook these together. Now, you can hook the Flegals together in Farming Simulator 19 now, so that purpose kind of takes it away. But this is a beautiful, beautiful trailer, and I love it. Next up, we have the Kroger Agroliner HKD302. Now, this is also in testing for PC, but under a different name, not under Kroger, so I can't understand that really. But nonetheless, we already have this trailer in game, and I can't understand why we would be getting another mod of this. Now, there's a couple reasons and ways that we could be and why we would be. One of those is that the modder said, hey, I like that trailer, I can make it better, let's do it. That's probably 100% what has gone on here. The modder has said, I can do that trailer better, let's do it. So they have done that. Um, Giants have also said that, hey, if we have something in the game, it can be altered if it is good enough. So that's probably what's going on here. Either way, I'm excited, it can only get better, and this is one of my favorite trailers in game. Next up, something that's probably going to be exciting a lot of people. This is the ITS Limken Pack. Yes, that is right. You remember this from Farming Simulator 17. If you played 17, uh, this has got some subsoilers, cultivators in here, a lot of cultivators. Um, and it also has something where you can go in and hook two implements together, making it longer, larger, whatever, however you feel. And I believe there were some planters that were in this as well, if I remember correctly. So that's really cool. Uh, it also comes with a piece where you can connect two different implements together, hook them side by side, all that good stuff. I hope that this comes. I really, really do, because this was an awesome mod. I know a lot of people used it. We also have a heating plant, which I assume to be probably a placeable wood chip place where you can take wood chips or wood and, and it would take it. Uh, we had something like that in 17 that was in base game. Uh, I don't think we have anything like that in 19. So it'd be really cool to have something like that. Also in console testing is the Flegal SDS 350. Uh, this is a semi trailer. This is really cool. It's a bell trailer basically, so you can hook stuff down to it, pallets, uh, bales, anything like that. Anything that could be held down, you could put it on here. And I'm sure you could probably figure out a way to get vehicles on here too. When this comes out, I'm sure we're gonna do crazy stuff with it. I'm very excited for this to come out. This has been out for PC as an unofficial mod for a while now. And I'm very excited to see it coming to console. We also have the DO24D024 trailer. Uh, the only thing I am pulling up on this is the BBM trailer. Yeah, that's right. The American trailer from Farming Simulator 9, or 17. I believe this was the American Bandit. Very, very cool. I love this trailer. I used it for a lot of different stuff. Well until the uh, Black Sheep modding trailer came out that went on the dually. But that's neither here nor there. That is on the wish list. This thing is awesome. I can't wait to see this. This next mod may be my favorite thing and the thing I'm most excited about on this. Buying Station 
all fruit. Now, PC has some stuff very similar to this. There are some people that have made mods like this. And to be completely honest with it, I use something similar to this when I do stuff on PC when I'm trying to be sneaky. Buying station, all fruit. What does that mean to you? Buying station. You can buy stuff. All fruit. All fruit, everything. Anything in game. Wheat, barley, oats, canola, sunflower, soybeans, corn, potatoes, sugar, beets. I mean, sugar cane. Let's go, baby. All fruit. That's what I'm talking about. Buying all fruit. I want that. I want that mod right now. Send it to me. DJ Goham Gaming at gmail.com. Let's go, baby. We also have the back and lifter pack. Now, this is going to be an update because simply put, we already have this in game. So this is going to be an update for the bag and lifter pack. I imagine, I mean, we've already had one update for it. So this is probably going to be update 1.2, I believe, or 1.3, something like that. Anyway, this is a great mod. It is a game changing mod. When it came out early on in Farming Simulator 19, a lot of people were excited about it, as am I. So thank you for continually updating it and improving it. That's is insane. Moving on to PC mods again. Some of these mods we may see on console. Some of them we may not. There's one or two on here I know we will never see. And we're going to go over those right now. We have the water station for PC. We have the realistic steering mod. The real clock mod, which we already have on PC. So I'm interested to see how that's going to go about. We also have the real dirt color, which is also on PC. We have a real, real dirt mod on there. Uh, so that may be something similar. It may not be. We have the PLN 635, which appears to be a plow. We have placeable storage silos, which is really cool. I'm hoping that those are going to be coming to console. I really, really do. And real dirt, guys, with that real dirt color, that needs to come to console. If you guys are watching this, Giants, please do what you can do to make it come to console. It's awesome mod. Everyone deserves to play that. Everyone does. Uh, we have, I don't know how to say this. I gotta be completely honest with you. I've been trying to try and try and we're just gonna call it the MBP9. Now the MBP9 keeps coming up as a trailer. And the one below that, the FMSZ2K. I can't even find anything on that. I can't even translate that. If Google can't do it, I can't do it. I gotta tell you. So <laughs> I'm not sure what either one of those are. I think they're trailers. If not, well, we'll just go for it. We'll just go for it. Uh, the Hodgip trailers keep coming up for the first one. It may just be a issue of the same name. Not quite sure is what it is. Next up, we have the Lizard Rumbler Van Workshop. Very, very cool. I'm guessing as the Lizard Rumbler Van, but with a workshop with it. So it's got like a movable placing workshop thing. That's pretty neat. Lizard Rumbler Van. Um, also, I don't think the Van Workshop is going to be coming to console, just to, just to say. I've seen a couple things like that come to PC, and they did not go to console. But the Lizard Rumbler Van... I imagine will be coming to console. So keep a lookout for that. Lighted bunker silo, very cool. Front loader camera. Again, I don't think that's gonna be coming to console. That's gonna have to change some scripts. If it does, awesome. I don't think it will, so don't look forward to it, but we'll see nonetheless. We have a Switzerland flag. We have the DMT4A Dimitra, which is a plower cultivator. Uh, the Class Axion 900. Now, if you guys are on console, just close your ears. I am pretty darn sure this has nothing to do with us. Um, of course, the Class Axion 900, you guys know this as a tractor. I don't foresee this coming to console because they do not own the rights for Class yet. So will they eventually? They are in a partnership. Yes, Class and Giants of Farming Simulator, they are in a partnership now. Things will be coming later on down the future. Um, if you guys have watched Virtual Farm Rarity, he has basically said, do not expect this for a long time. A long time. Probably at the one-year mark is when they'll announce or something similar to that. So get excited, but don't get your hopes up. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Uh, BioBelt's Tandem Timber Trailer TLT500. That is... What it says is a tandem timber trailer, wood trailer. We have the Agro Liner HKD 302. So it's the same thing as on console. This has got to be the same thing. So it is the same mod. It just doesn't say Kroger in front of it. Maybe it isn't. Maybe it is. I don't know. And then we have the 140 PB 95, which is a trailer. 
That's a long list. <laughs> and we've got 196 mods in testing. Well, guys, that is going to do it for us today. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. If you know already, please subscribe. If you have any questions about these, let me know down in the comment section below. Also, if you guys have stayed this long, make sure you go check out the description. I will leave a link to where I found this list so you guys can go check it out for yourself. You can look through it, search things, do it for yourself, and have a good time doing it. So, that being said, hope you have a great day. We will see you later. Peace.